안녕하세요 여러분, 토니입니다. Hello everyone, it's Tony. So hot off the heels of part one and two, we are finally checking out the last part, part number three of our reaction to Twice's third full album, being titled Formula of Love. Of Love. O plus T equals less than three. Now, if you didn't know what that last part means, that's once plus twice equals love, equals heart. And I am all for it because we do love these girls. We are big ones ourselves. And with that being said, if you want to check out our reactions to part one, part two, the music video, the title track, Scientist, or even checking out their live performance for the track off this album, Candy, you can find it all linked in the description box below, as well as if you want to check out any of our previous twice reactions, covers, live performance, solo projects, melody projects, dance practices, English, Korean, Japanese stuff. You can find it all linked in the twice plays down description box below. Hopefully you do check out another video. But with that being said, let's not waste any more time. I'd love to know from you guys though. Are you a once? And if so, even if not, what are your top three tracks from this album? Let me know in the comments. So without further ado though, we're going to get off where we last left off on track number 10 being titled Cactus. So without further ado, Lego. Oh, there's like this staticky radio feel to it. It's, oh, is this gonna be like an old school like melody ballad? Oh, oh, it is. Oh, I'm gonna cry. This hits so much more because of the fact that this year marks the sixth debut year like their sixth debut anniversary dang okay oh the echo oh i can totally see this used as a soundtrack for like a twice thing and then to that extent i could totally see this being like a really like awesome concert like with once thing because like light sticks in the air mwah, like you'll give the shivers holy my the rock element gives it a bit of like like the electric guitar gives it a bit of like almost a kind of like grandiose kind of western a ballad feel to it almost it's really really awesome Definitely, I could see this as like a concert pleaser, like awesome, like live. Hey man, hey man, ooh, Nyan. Ooh, there's picking up pace. It's really nice. I'll be fine. I like how in all of these tracks so far up from this album kind of Mina's been that kind of like cutting factor like her t her voice is a little bit more kind of like sharp I would say it just cuts through everything and then here in this case they kind of use that kind of like almost like this like that radio effect to push her voice kind of like to stand out it's really nice Wow, the softness is just tan, like it's just shaking. Ooh. Oh, Momo's voice here. Oh, it's so nice. Oh, that little piano just do 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 like that. It's such a simple thing, but it 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 makes me shiver. This is gonna be an awesome song with like lights, cause like they'll I can see the stage already like going and then like when they do the saving part. Wow. Oh and there's like a bit of a background chant now going. Shay? Shui I think? Oh, 
has a feels like a bit of a western feel it's awesome okay okay geo i love how like kind of raspy it is almost like soft it is save me jungyeon save me it's awesome it's awesome this song is awesome too Oh yeah, Cactus is definitely up there. Uh, I don't know if it takes the spot in my top three though, but it's definitely, if not top three, top five, no doubt. Because I think in my in my top five I have Candy, and I definitely see that Cactus is like right where Candy is in my opinion. So with that being said though, the next three tracks are tracks that like essentially three like a third of each of the girl gr girls did together so the first one is called is titled push and pull and this one is uh which which one is it uh, give me a second push and pull this one is geo uh oh sorry geo sana sana diane so i'm really excited for this so without further ado let's start it up This one's, I think, the one that keeps, like, connection most to, like, the retro feel. Okay, Diane. It has a really nice kind of like jazzy feel to it and it's a bit different I would say than ooh you can take Oh I like this da 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 I like that I really like that it has like that reminds me a lot of like kind of the old retro feel that they're trying to capture here. It's nice. The song is really nice, and obviously the highlight for me is that we get to hear more of Sana, Gio, and Dayan in like this. Especially Dayan and Sana, I would say. The trumpet section is... It's nice. Oh, that's Gio doing the rap. That's interesting. I didn't think like that. And here, you also get like a mix of the roles. So you got Gio doing a bit of rap, Diane doing more vocals. You know, it's a cool mix up for the experiment. <laughs> oh, I like that. You losing control. <laughs> like Sana, so cute there. Oh, <laughs> 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 cool. Thank you. 
Fate and cool. The, like, towards the tailing end, I really grew on me. Like, the chorus and, like, the kind of swagger that it brought about it. Very cool. Very nice. The next song is Hello by Nayan, Momo, and Cheyoung. Ooh. Ooh, this has a bit of a different vibe to it. Definitely not kind of, like, following maybe what the album is, but definitely very nice. Hello, we run this city. You litty? Okay. I can definitely see Che having an influence on this, just because I feel like Che would have liked having this, but surprising, but not at the same time that, like, you have Nan Nayeon and Momo together. That's, like, kind of, like, you know, best friends right there. But still, I it's it's interesting. It's really interesting. Like, it feels like kind of, like, street-esque vibes. Hello. Liddy, yeah. Oh, Momo's like kind of like uniqueness of her voice is really cool playing here as a rap. It's like chi Oh. Huh? I'm gonna be honest, that, that change was very kind of like almost abrupt to nature. So I was, I'm like, oh, where's Nyan coming off? And it's interesting how they cut it off. But instead here, the beat is still the same beat. It's just that they're using different instruments to create that effect. That's why it sounds somewhat similar though still. Oh, there's a flute in the background, isn't it? Hello, wait, all right. Oh, Nayan! So good! <laughs> the verses are probably my favorite part of this song. What, 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 what? Yeah. Nayan, ah, ah, hey, this is a really fun song. I like this. The flute is a really interesting addition. Oh, I was gonna think they're gonna say they're chaining. Fanfare in the air, in the air, Fanfare hands in the air, Fanfare hands in the air, Fanfare, hands in the air, ayy! Fanfare, hands in the air, ayy! Fanfare, hands in the air, ayy! Hello, we are from this city, yeah? So cool, I So cool! I like that from Nyan. Hello, we are from this city, Ooh! I like that. Oh, and we got an ad, so I'll pause, but let me... I'll come back to what I was gonna say. So, put, uh, hello, honestly really cool really swaggy really different kind of like out of left field in when you think about this album but i really really love it i really enjoy it and of the two that we've heard so far i would say hello is up there honestly really cool really awesome and the last one that we have to check out the last song that we have to check out from this album that we haven't checked out already is titled one three oh sorry not three two bye john Yan, Mina, and Chewie. I'm excited to check this one out. And without further ado, that's what we're gonna about to do. Let's go. Interesting. Has a bit of like an island vibe, you know, man. Kind of like. Hmm. 
Chewy is nice here. Oh, the with Mina. Oh, the clock. Sorry. Ooh, there's some like it has like this almost like Middle Eastern flair to it with the instrumentation. It's really very special, very distinct. I think it makes it. A, I would say that for me, the of the three songs, I would rank my favorites from like Hello, One, Three, Two, and then Push and Pull. Just because I feel like Push and Pull, it's kind of very, very similar to the album, which is not bad because they followed that. But I think that in terms of just like like how I like the song, the catchiness, I would say that's the order for me. Again, you can let me know in the comments what your thoughts are. Mina's voice is beautiful here, I would honestly say. This is so interesting. Like it's so out of, just like Hello. It's a very different from what like, what I've ever heard from Twice in general. So it's really cool to hear. What it, it's so like it so works, you know. Okay, a little bit of rap section. I like how it gets a little bit more bassy. Oh, Chewy? Okay! That was, that, like, rap section was unexpected, but I really like it. It like broke everything out, cut everything up. Kinda like woke you up. It's awesome. And how like Chewy is coming off of Jungyeon, the like interchanging is really smooth. Okay, so we have finally checked out the entire album of Formula of Love. One zero oh, plus three. It's once plus twice equals love. I would say like there's obviously three tracks remaining. Candy we already checked out. Obviously, as I mentioned, linked in the description box. But then there's the feels in Korean, which we've checked out the English one. It's in the playlist, so I would check that out. And then Sci Scientist Rehab Remix that we haven't checked out. But we've already checked out Scientist, so I'm going to leave that uh, to where it is. Overall, an awesome album. Definitely, like, I would say really, really highlight songs in all of this. And it's really cool that we got some of the these songs from the girls kind of, like, making it themselves, breaking up into groups, doing something a bit different, a bit out of the box. And it's really cool. I hope that they keep on doing these things and doing, like, these kind of, like, almost way subunit projects, which would be awesome to hear more of, see more of. And overall, this is an awesome album. I can't wait to re-listen to the notable ones I love so much. But again, I'd love to get your thoughts on which ones are your top three. Let me know in the comment section below. And again, if you want to check out parts one or two, the scientist music video, Candy, anything of the sort, you can find it linked in the description box below as well as in the Twice playlist. So hopefully do check out another video. But with that being said, guys, thank you so much for watching. Come And as always, if you have any comments, questions, or something on top, feel free to leave in the comment section below. And I'll get to you as soon as possible. With that being said, guys, it's been Tony. It's 2 a.m. in the morning for me, so I'm gonna finally go to sleep. But hopefully you guys enjoy all these videos. Until then, Bye-bye, guys. Annyeong. Bye.